Whatever he wants to do, he can do it. Because what happens in this thing called life in this world, when we get 365 days a year, there's going to be an attack on you, right? It's not always bad. Some people just do not understand where you're trying to go. It's so like me. I created a company called Corey's World Incorporated. And everyone thinks that it's about me. But no, it's about, I forgot the guy's name that was just up here speaking about cooperative work, about uh, teamwork, about capacity building, innovation, networking, right? You cannot be successful in this world if you don't build relationships, right? Mm -hmm. All that stuff that I'm talking about I do, I rely on computers just in case a guy can't help you with it. But even then, that's not enough because you need people standing in front. You need to be able to touch a good looking guy like this, right? So as you travel your journey, whether that's to go directly to college, right? Or if that's just to go directly into entrepreneur, invest time into your craft. I spend 12 hours a day on the computer. I run three miles a day. I walk, spend time with my daughter, my son, my wife, my family, and you guys, right? Because I don't know if you guys have noticed lately, people are just dropping, right? I mean, you wake up in the morning, the guy's gone. I'm like, hey, I was in the middle of a text message. And that scared me. So one of my mentors told me, he said, Corey, you know what, stop dreaming. He said, just do, Pop. right? As soon as he said, stop dreaming and do, that's when I really took on the role to stand in front of you guys and say I'm a computer programmer, because that's what I am, right? I don't know if it was the world or some guy in Google telling me that, hey, you're not a computer programmer because you're not me, or you don't look like me, or you don't stand like me, or you don't come from where I come from. No, you can put a computer in front of me and I'm gonna do backwards, right? So I stand and I own that. If you're an athlete, you can run, you're fast, right? You're smart, you're efficient, you're effective. It just does not stop where you are. Everything that's going on in the back of your brain that you think is weird, it's real. It's real. Seriously, you wake up in the morning like, you know what, maybe I should design an app called Google to where people can go on their phones and click. How many times do I look at my phone a day? And you'll find the answer. You thought that guy was out of his mind? Right, but that's what we rely on every day of every second of every hour. And it's not specifically our ideas, right? It's our capacity of thinking and what can we make real to us. So wherever you go in this world, young man, young lady, old woman, old man, wherever you are, walking, wheelchair, skating, or riding a bike, it does not matter. You're good enough right where you are. And I'll tell you how, how I know that. Because I shut the world out around me, right? And I had to communicate, it was difficult. So that's when I start to really practice on myself. I looked in the mirror and said, hey, Corey, you're not as cool as you think you are. You're not as smart as you think you are. You're not as accountable as you think you are. And I started to look back at all the things that I dropped the ball on, and I became one of those things, and I said, you know what? It's a new guy right here. That's why I introduced myself loudly, and boldly, because if you knew me then, it's probably different now, because I'm on a different mission, I'm on a different role, I'm on a different route. I'm looking to build, connect, engage, and just give it all I have personally while I still have the time on this earth. So everyone in this room that's talking about relationship building and capacity building, it starts there. But you will not, okay, and I'll leave on this. Everybody take a breather, because this is when it gets really hard. You're gonna have to take care of yourself first. Yeah. Yeah, right? Guy wakes up in the morning, first thing he does is fix his daughter some waffles. Come on, man, brush your teeth for it. Right? You gotta take care of yourself first. You got to. And whatever that looks like in your world, right? It might be getting rid of Facebook. It might be logging on to Facebook, right? It might be getting on to TikTok, getting off of TikTok. It might be incorporating your business or dissolving your business. Take care of yourself first. I love you. Yay.